Another light show in the skies above western Washington last night. It is a reminder of just how much material is orbiting our planet. As King 5 environmental reporter Michael Crow shows us tonight, that has an impact on our ability to study space as well. If you were outside last night, you may have noticed some strange lights speeding across the sky. Turns out those were SpaceX satellites and raised some interesting discussions about what we put in orbit. I mean, what could it be? A string of lights drew eyes to the sky Tuesday night, a bizarre sight visible across western Washington. It just like keeps moving. But there is a very terrestrial explanation, a SpaceX launch for a batch of its Starlink satellites. They get just bundled in this tight little package on the rocket. And then when they reach orbit, they sort of open the open the doors and they drop the satellites out kind of in a big string in a big line. Doesn't it like feel like it's going to come down, but it's not? This is the second SpaceX spectacle in a little more than a month. Wow. Oh my God, I'm going get it. At the end of March, stargazers were shocked by this display, a disintegrating rocket entering the Earth's atmosphere, a piece of which landed in Grant County. The Starlink project will use thousands of satellites to provide high-speed internet, but raises concerns from those that study the night sky. But there is something to be said for putting this much material in orbit, right? It's definitely a concern, and it's not just Starlink, it's not just uh, SpaceX and Elon Musk, it's lots of companies. Satellites can reflect light from the sun, creating problems for the sensitive instruments pointed out into the universe. What we saw last night was the most extreme example. They had just been launched a few hours earlier, and so they're super bright, bright enough that you can just go outside and see them. They do go up higher, and when that happens, they do get fainter. You won't be able to see them when they get to their parking orbit at like 300 miles up. But we can see them with big telescopes. But he notes our use of outer space has benefits to society too. But like many natural resources, it's important to balance that use with preservation, an environmental discussion that extends well beyond the confines of this planet. Michael Crow, King 5 News.